Sure. Uh, number one, and, and I think this comes down to the question of jobs, and um, Mr. Pez is absolutely right. Uh, we may be looking at the first generation uh, that will not have the, a better opportunity than the generation before them. Um, that is, by and large, due to horrendously bad decisions being made by the government that have made it more difficult for you, that have caused, co caused college tuition to increase, that have made jobs fewer, that have made wages stagnant. What can be done? Well, economic growth is what needs to be done, and economic growth um, is a three-headed monster, essentially. It is, uh, first and foremost, a balanced budget. Uh, I'm a CPA uh, by profession before I was in the FBI, and we always knew that when you balance books, you create jobs. That is a fundamental pr principle of business. We need to balance the budget. That is first and foremost, and we need a balanced budget amendment to do it, which is a shame that we need to, to actually amend the Constitution to keep government officials to follow the principle that every family in America follows and that every business in America follows, which is you only spend what you take in. Second is zero-based budgeting, which is part and parcel to balancing the budget. Every family in America and virtually every business in America, the way they run their budget every year is they start from the ground up. And every single year for every single line on it, they have to justify. That is not how the government is run today. <clears throat> the way the government is run today is every single bureaucracy, most of them bloated, take last year's budget, they carry it over to the, the, the next year, and they add a, a CPI percentage to it. And the third thing is single issue legislation, which, again, I mean, these are all linked together. We have omnibus bills that are passed in Congress that are loaded with completely unrelated items. And it, it stops progress, especially in the economic front, when we need to pass legislation that actually make it easier for people to get work, that make it more likely that wages will increase. Those are three ideas that I think would help our economy uh, instantly if we could implement them instantly.